Hey there, it's E Squared Photography. I'm Erin. And I'm Emily. And we are here to keep things simple and fun. Have you heard a little bit about AI coming into the world? Well, it's here and it's here for photographers and we are so excited about it. We are going to share the inside scoop today. We are going to be talking all about an AI editing software called Imagine and how amazing it is and how it can be super helpful for you. And stick around until the end because we have something that is going to help you tremendously. By the end of this video, you are going to truly see how efficient you can become as a photographer by using this software. And don't forget, for the best photography tips and tricks, make sure to subscribe to our channel and hit that bell for notifications of future videos. So this particular software called Imagine has saved us tons and tons of time already, especially when it comes to our editing process. And we are absolutely amazed how great and accurate this has been for us. Okay, so what is this AI Imagine software that we're talking about and we love? What it is, is it analyzes your previous photo edits that you've done to create your own personal AI profile. You can then apply the profile to your Lightroom Classic catalog at less than half a second per photo. So what it does is it really takes and analyzes what type of editing style you use already, and then it automatically will apply it to a Lightroom catalog for you very, very quickly, within minutes to your entire catalog. It is amazing. And stick around until the end because we have 1,500 free edits that we can give you from Imagine to start using the software today. So let's specifically talk about how the setup works. The setup for this is completely free. Yes, the setup is free. You also do not need to put in any credit card information whatsoever to use the free 1500 edits that we're gonna give you. Okay, so part of the setup, first of all, the setup is so easy to do and to follow. You are asked to upload 3000 or more images that you already have edited. So what we did was we picked some of our favorite Lightroom galleries and we uploaded those. So we looked through past sessions that we had saved on our hard drive, pulled those Lightroom galleries into Imagine and finally reached our 3000 plus images that they need in order to give you the profile that you want. So once you've uploaded these images and they are happy with the amount that you've done, again, 3000 is that little key number you need to look for. Then Imagine is going to analyze your edits to create an AI profile based on those edits. And it's insane the accuracy it does. All right, so then what? Then when you are ready, you can upload an unedited Lightroom gallery. So let's say you had a photo shoot, you've called the photos maybe even, and you've put them into a Lightroom gallery. You now can upload that gallery without even touching the images or starting to edit them into Imagine. So you upload those that Lightroom gallery and then Imagine is going to do its work. And inside of there, you can select a bunch of different options. Again, it's super easy to follow along with what they want from you, but you can, you can ask it to call for you. You can ask it to crop, straighten. You can even do subject mask and more and more is coming along the way. So there's lots of things you can have it do for you. We've kind of played around with all of it. We're loving it, but it is amazing. So you upload that gallery, you select what you want it to do. You can even say, I only want to edit the ones that are five star rated inside my Lightroom catalog. Now keep in mind, the more and more you use this tool, the better and better it gets at understanding what you want. Then it does its magic so quickly, within minutes, you have an edited gallery. And then once it's complete, it's analyzed, it's edited, then they ask you to, they are, you are directed to open it back up in Lightroom. So you are directed to open that gallery up inside of Lightroom and all of the images you selected, the images you wanted are going to be edited based on how they analyzed and created that profile for you. Then you can take the time to be creative as a photographer and fine tune and tweak those images in the Lightroom gallery. So Imagine has edited them, but you might wanna add some of your own little tweaks that you like as the, the artistic side of you, or maybe you wanna warm them up a little bit. 
or maybe you want to crop in and really, really tight on some of them, you can go ahead and do that. And then one of the most important pieces, once you are happy with that gallery, then you are going to re-upload it to Imagine for them to see what they can improve on and learn so they can keep adjusting to the way you want it and get it as perfect as possible. All right, let's talk about a few additional things that are important when it comes to using Imagine or other things that you can use it for. So let's say that maybe you shoot newborns and you shoot weddings and maybe you do some indoor headshots in a studio. Well, those can be very different edits based on the style that you have. So you can have as many profiles created as you want. So for example, you may want to do a black and white profile, or maybe you strictly want an indoor profile and an outdoor profile, or maybe your family photography edits are different than your senior photography edits and you want two different profiles. That is totally fine. You can build another profile. One other really cool feature, especially for new photographers who still are trying to figure out what their style is, is they Imagine has talent profile options. And what this is, it's other photographers editing styles that they can use and apply to their images and tweak them as they like and really come up with their own profile based on those. So if you are unsure about your editing style, that is a good place to start. Now, Imagine is extremely easy to use and I know that we've been saying it, but it couldn't be easier. And one really important thing to remember with Imagine, you're always in control you can review the results in Lightroom and tweak them and Imagine will continue to learn and evolve with you. So just keep that in mind when you're working with it. So if your editing style is evolving over time, Imagine will learn that. Comment below and let us know what is your biggest frustration when it comes to editing right now. So we hope this was helpful and we hope you are excited to give it a try. And don't forget that we have a link in the description below for 1500 free edits, no credit card information is required. Try it out. We promise you will not regret it. You are going to love it. And if you enjoyed this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and share with a friend so we know to make more videos just like this one. And if you don't already, follow us on Instagram at esquared.photography, and we will see you next time.